Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Delhi Tarot and these are your money, career, finance, focus reading for the sun, moon and the rising sign of cancer. Please keep in mind that this is your money, career reading for the next three months. It's a group general reading. So please pick it up what resonates with you. Please leave the rest for others. And if you really like what I do on the channel, please do like, subscribe the channel and put on the notifications. Now for any personal private reading, my email ID, my website, my number is mentioned in the description box below. And when you're sending an email to me or a WhatsApp messages, please do mention your complete name and your time zone. Uh, because I am in a different time zone and all personal private readings are paid processes. Please connect with me with that understanding. Now let us see what messages do we have for the month of April, May and June. Cancer people, I'm going to do the reading for all the three months, the oracle card reading and the tarot card reading. And in the end, I'm also going to pull out one advice card for each and every month. Let us see what messages do we have for the month of April, money, career, finances. You have your first chakra, Archangel Michael, your stability, your security of your professional life, your career, your money, your finances is going to be the concern in the month of April and you also have a card of choose a new direction. The current uh, work which you are doing, the current profession, the role which you are doing, you have an instinct, you have an intuition that it is not taking you in the direction you want to build up your career, you want to grow, you want to have a good name, fame, recognition. However, you are really concerned about the longevity of the particular task and also when I see this particular card, I do see that the future seems to be not so secure from your point of view. And that is why you have an angel divine intervention with a very, very clear message, Cancer people, that it is time for you to choose a new direction and it is time for you to put all your hard work into something which resonates more with you which gives you better job satisfaction. And when I see this particular card combination, the Oracle card combination, I do feel that your skills, your competencies, your cap capability and your, you know, your capacity to perform in some other role, some other kind of work, some other kind of profession is very, very high. So whatever you are currently doing, maybe you are not in the best of your role, and that is why you are not able to give 100%. And even if you are trying to give 100%, you are not feeling extremely happy, contented and satisfied with whatever you are doing. There is a very important and a serious call for you to think about it. Do self-introspection and choose a direction which gives you contentment, satisfaction both even after putting your hard work, something which excites you, which gives you joy, which, which makes you feel that yes, this is the passion, this is the interest which I have to continue for very, very long. Let us see what messages do we have in your tarot reading. You have a new journey coming in. Now, there is a very, very clear tarot card and a very, very clear oracle card that it's time for you to plan, go for a new journey. You need to take that risk. You need to take that leap of faith. But you do have all the capa capacity to start a new profession into new line of work. However, the fool do have a tendency of following because fool do not plan everything well in advance. So you have to plan things accordingly. But yes, there is a very important call for you to think about a new line of work, new direction change, because that is going to be your life, divine soul purpose in this particular life. And you have a card of king of wands and you have a card of justice. Now, this is a karmic change it's a divine intervention when I was reading this card The choose a new direction. This means that when you feel that there is a break, there is a halt, there is an insecurity with the current profession, current work which you are doing, the stability, the, you know, the, the power to stay in that particular work is little weak. This is the divine intervention that what you are doing currently, cancer people, you are not meant to do that. It's time for you to lead your passion. It's time for you to realize what you want to do 
and take a call accordingly. However, people who are looking forward to raise promotion, yes, with the help of people all around, you will be able to receive the best of help to grow, to have this transformation, to have this shift. But ultimately, finally, this is going to be your own big decision that yes you want to change your line of work and you want to start from scratch for a new line of work now let us see what messages or what one advice card do we have from your tarot deck and you do have king of wands oh my goodness same month reading and you have two cards which are getting repeated King of Wands says that with your high energy, high passion, you will be able to build up something very big, something very strong, a leader kind of position, a, somebody who leads a group, who influences a group. And yes, people do follow them. So yes, this could be your own entrepreneurship. This could be a role which, which talks about managing, leading people. But yes, a raise, a growth a movement up is definitely sure in the month of April. Now let us see what messages do we have in the month of May. You have woman holding a heart and you have a trust. Yes, with this card there is a there is a big professional help coming your way. This could not necessarily be a female but a male or a female who will come for your help. To give you guidance, to give you the path and to make you realize that you are meant and you are born to do something bigger and something different. The only thing is that you have to trust this change which is coming into your mindset, into your thought process or into the way you are feeling towards your profession or to your career. So trust your gut feeling. Trust your intuition. Follow the advice of your well-wishers, of your seniors. Somebody will help you to realize your capability and your passion very, very soon. Now, let us see what tarot reading do we have for you for the month of May for your money, career, finances. You do have a card of page of sword. You have ace of cups. And you do have a card of the strength. Now, when I see this particular card, this is a very strong Leo energy. Yes, you need to be bold. You need to be courageous enough to take that step for yourself. You need to be assertive. And yes, there is a possibility that if you want to begin something new, there should be a calculated risk. You need to be secure and safe with your finances. Whatever you are trying to invest, pour into your own work or if you are planning to start something of your own, yes, the boldness, the courage needs to be with the calculated risk and with the help of Ace of Cups, there is an opportunity which is coming your way but through reference, through word of mouth, things are going to improve very very soon and yes expect a lot of messages phone calls which is related to struck communication which is related to halted communication which means that yes you know you are waiting for some answer you are waiting for a result you are waiting for some communication to happen related to something which you have already initiated in the past few weeks or past few months maybe you will be waiting for the you're waiting for an interview result or a deal result that kind of communication the updates the communication the reply the response is going to come to you very very soon but yes expect a lot of references related work and word of mouth related work now let us see what one advice card do we have for you for the month of may and you do have a card of temperance fire and water mix and match it's an advice for you that don't be impulsive don't be aggressive be away from any fire like situation which means be away from any kind of hot discussion hot communication which can lead to a big workplace dispute or workplace conflict it's time for you to have a calculated talk at your workplace 
and it's time for you to you know really be very very careful be choosy with your words with your expressions and be away from drama of others and just be you know restricted to your own requirements and it's also the time for you to take each and every step very very carefully the month of may is definitely the month of taking complete precaution and taking any conscious move or conscious step now let us see what messages do we have for the month of june we do have first chakra archangel gabriel and this is definitely related to your communication you can neither afford to have a very loud call of anything or loud expression simultaneously it's, it's it will get difficult for you to stand up for your belief or you know to stand up for the truth you feel for anything so have very very you know very clear communication relevant communication not just in the month of may but even in the month of june and yes expect big happy changes now this happy changes is not related to an opportunity or the money coming your way for me the energies of the cards are saying that this big happy changes are going to come in the form of situation changing into your favor things turning up into your favor i do feel that you are going to get lot of clarity for your career ahead you are going to get lot of clarity what you want to pick up next what you want to do next you will be very sorted with your professional relationship i also feel that you will be very sorted that yes this is the line of work i want to go forward in my life and this is something i really don't want to do more into my life this is the clarity of your long term future your long term professional life your long term career which you are going to get and this clarity is going to help you a very very long way and the energies i'm getting from this card is very very positive because it says that this will bring lot of recovery to your mindset and this will bring lot of holistic development to your mindset very very soon now let us see what tarot reading do we have for you for the month of june and you have got two of wands you have got seven of swords and you have got nine of swords so if you see there are more of swords in the month of june which says communication wise this month is going to be little tough rather i do see that there could be conflicts there could be fights as well and the, this is definitely giving you little anxiety little stress but this is not a new situation this is an old situation which is lingering on so clear communication you know uh, is very important and you should be the first one in taking the lead to offer solutions in offering resolutions even if that calls out for a compromise for an adjustment keeping all the ego pride aside aside just see that you are able to resolve the situation completely and nicely and with two of wands this is a sign symbol and an indication that in time to come there is a possibility that you will have multiple opportunities multiple careers and there will be multiple you know income sources as well from two parallel professions but the amount of hard work you are going to put in these professions is going to be very 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 you know high in terms of what you were doing in the previous time so yes multiple careers multiple opportunities coming your way and all the opportunities are going to be good be extremely choosy be extremely careful take your time in making an important decision now let us see what advice do we have for all my dear cancer people for the month of june and we do have two of cups now for a lot of you this is going to be true uh there is a call for a partnership for an association with a friend a relationship a friendly relationship is going to get converted into a business into a venture into an entrepreneurship and if you see your months consecutively in the month of uh, may and june you'd have you know cups that to into a money career reading that means the change which is coming to you is going to come to through the intervention of a family of a friend somebody coming forward to give you an opportunity to collaborate to work for them 
but trust me this opportunity is coming to you because you are capable and the person must have seen your skills your capacity your competency for this particular venture so i do feel that this new direction is going to come to you in a form of a partnership in a form of a you know in a form of a collaboration wherein you will be called to join the organization to share your experience your expertise as a partner but yes go ahead with this because this is going to be your luck your destiny in time to come now let us see what angel message do we have with angel number 8 8 and 3 let us see what angel number 88 3 do we have for you and it says you are receiving divinely guided help with your career and finances primarily from the ascender masters such as jesus saints ganesh and so forth and this particular information this particular guidance is the meaning is the sense that you are going to receive the next work the next career change the next line of direction through someone who is known to you or someone who is distinctly known to you but yes some reference work some reference project is definitely going to change the complete direction of your career be open to that try to explore is as much as possible take time in taking the decision do let me know how you resonated with your money career reading for the next 3 months yes your personal private reading can be different because it is done as per your date of birth your time and yes it has your energy your aura and your personal cards can be little different and it has lot of remedies and solutions when we do that i will see you next time very soon be blessed